think for over 60, yeah, 60 years or so, I'm insulin controlled uh, and I'm, I'm very healthy. And one of the things that uh, us diabetics like to do is to sneak candies and eat sweets. And in my lifestyle, I have these little chocolate uh, Hershey's candies, which are, you know, just the little ones about the size of a pat of butter. And I'm continuously nibbling on them all day. Uh, and the, the craving for them stopped yesterday. I realized last night when I was going to bed that there was, I didn't eat any of those candies at all. I also crave uh, chocolate chip cookies. I've got some. I didn't have any of those. And when it came to be lunchtime, I didn't, I wasn't really hungry. I mean, it was like two o'clock when I said, well, I better eat something. So I had a little cottage cheese for lunch. And then last night for dinner, I fixed myself the regular sized dinner. And I was only able to eat half of it. Isn't that strange? So the whole idea of this is to, um, if you just have one cup a day of, of the coffee, uh, it increases your physical and your mental energy. It uh, enhances the mental focus and clarity. It promotes a sense of fullness. And I, I felt that. I mean, I didn't feel like stuffing food in my mouth. Uh, so that is uh, part of the fullness, promote a sense of fullness, and promote mood and emotional health. Okay. And encourage weight and fat loss. <laughs> you know, us older men, we, we get a sag in the, in the stomach. Uh, belly fat is what they call it. And when I first started on the program, I was taking the pills, which the company offers if people don't like to drink coffee or it's against uh, their religion. And drinking, uh, drinking the coffee, this is my second day, and with the effects being noticeable right away, which is really neat. I mean, we, uh, we have a promotion of where we offer you a free product, you know, try it before you like it. That way you don't buy a, a, a can of it and, and decide, well, you know, I spent the money for it and I tasted it and I don't like it. 